Ever wondered what really happens when a plane comes into land? It's not just about lowering the wheels and touching the runway. Behind every smooth landing, there's a strict set of protocols in action. Let's break it down. As the plane approaches its destination, the pilots receive clearance from air traffic control to start descending. This is called the top of descent. Passengers see the seatbelt sign turn on, while cabin crew begins final checks. The aircraft doesn't drop straight down. It descends step by step, reducing speed gradually. The pilots stay in constant contact with ATC to coordinate their altitude and position. As the runway comes into view, ATC assigns a specific approach path, like ILS or RNAV. Pilots extend the flaps and lower the landing gear. The aircraft slows down, aligns with the runway and gets ready to land. In the final moments, the aircraft is stabilized, meaning it's on the right path, at the right speed and ready to land. Just before touching down, the nose lifts slightly in a move called the flare, and the wheels gently hit the runway. Once on the ground, the spoilers pop up to reduce lift, and reverse thrust helps slow the plane. Brakes bring the aircraft to a safe speed before turning onto the taxiway. After exiting the runway, the pilots follow ground control instructions to taxi to the gate. Once parked, engines are shut down and passengers disembark safely. And that's how a plane lands, through careful coordination, communication and precise control. Next time you fly, you'll know just how much work goes into that smooth touchdown.